Le'Veon Bell, still not with the team, still not telling the team when they can expect Knowing him. that this kid right here has outperformed his contract, pay him his money. I think Steelers he should. recently announced they will not use a tag on the running back who sat out all of last year. They're possibly letting go one of the best running backs in franchise. He's going to be four years, $52.5 million for Le'Veon Bell in the New York Jets. man takes a year off of football, comes back, he gets what he wants. He gets what he wants. There really is no end in sight. There's been no progress. John Gruden has been pretty outspoken about needing to get that situation. In the impression of the people I've spoken to, the Raiders have no imminent interest in dealing Khalil Mack. Because Khalil Mack is headed to the Bears. It wasn't my goal to trade Khalil when we got here, but here we are today. To be wanted, that's all it takes. He also agrees to terms on a six-year, $141 million contract extension. Unfortunately, we had a standoff with the contract, and uh, we could not come to terms. It happened fast. It's been a whirlwind. I'm blessed and I'm thankful and I'm glad to be here. Glad to be here. Glad to be here. Jarvis Landry on his way from Miami to Cleveland. Four years that I did have to have the opportunity to play for the Miami Dolphins, I left it all there. Cleveland Browns talked about changing the atmosphere and the bravado of their team, the culture. Yeah. They want dog. I don't think not too many people still believe me, but I am very excited about the opportunity that's in front of us, about the guys that's in this building, about the city of Cleveland. And I'm looking forward to it. Looking forward to it. Looking forward to it. Earl Thomas planning to hold out unless he gets a new deal in Seattle. He didn't get a new deal, but he is back today. Now Earl is down inside the tent. Nobody wants to see this. You never want to see a guy get injured and be out for the year, and especially for a guy like Earl who's trying to get a new contract. Well, so many people are wondering, Kane, does he really have the market that everyone thought he had? The answer was yes. It is a huge deal for Earl Thomas and the Baltimore Ravens. Thank you for the organization for giving me a shot, especially coming off of injury. I'm here to do what I always do, and that's ball. It's a historic franchise. Guys like Ray Lewis, Ed Reed, I have that type of swagger. That's my style of play. Style of play. Speaking of letting guys walk, I'm looking at Landon Collins. Giants declined to use the franchise tag on safety Landon Collins, meaning he's now a free agent. He was going through the turmoil that was going on up there and all the craziness, all the trades, all the cuts. I was like, I don't think I'm here either. Giants love Landon Collins as a player, as a locker room guy, everything about him. This was really just about the value that he brings. They do believe that he's much more of a box safety. He doesn't play in the post. Once I saw a couple of guys that I was brought in with, it was like, I don't think I'm going to finish here either. I'm glad it happened, because now I'm in that Bergen and go. Bergen and go. Big trade that really rocked the NFL yesterday. Alex Smith goes to Washington. They immediately sign him to an extension, which means Kirk Cousins will no longer be a Redskin. He's now a free agent. Kirk Cousins is going to be the highest profile free agent that we have seen in years. Everybody wants Kirk Cousins. He's the hot ticket right now. Kirk Cousins scheduled to visit the Minnesota Vikings today. And the Vikings seem like the most likely landing spot. Vikings are expected to sign Kirk Cousins to a three-year contract that is fully guaranteed. On one hand, this, this process has moved quickly this week. On the other hand, it's been a two and a half year process. The belief they've shown in me means more than I can put into words. Ultimately, the pitch is, will we win football games? And the answer here is, I, I, I believe we will. I believe we will.